fumble that last drive that backfired CD, but really not as badly as it could. Their defense held up and only gave up three points. And what they want to do is play off the momentum the defense gave them, only giving up the three points in that situation after they failed on four. That's caught inside the 20. A big play there for Minnesota. 63 yards. The defense, they weren't fooled on that post route. They just couldn't make the play. Third quarter here, second and 10. Off the play fake, Cousins. And he's got this to Jefferson. Especially in a spot like this, fourth quarter, as you said, trying to cling to that advantage. Yeah, that one probably should have been picked, huh? And this will be caught at the 30. A big play there for Minnesota. 48 yards. What a game it's been for this duo. They remind me of a good comedy team. They know how to play off of each other so well. No matter how one riffs, the other's right there to pick them up, and they are shredding them in this ballgame. Home free yet, but it's looking good as they come up first and ten. And he's got it. Touchdown, Vikings. Kirk Cousins on the connection to Justin Jefferson. And the Vikings get an important score there to extend their lead here in this fourth quarter. Well, on that connection, it looked like they maybe had some pre-play communication. Maybe one of them noticed an area that was open to the defense to get the pass to. From the shotgun, it's Cousins. And they work this well upfield across the 45. They give them 27 yards on the third down conversion. In this weather, any big play in the passing game, that's that's just a bonus, right? It certainly is, but oftentimes offenses think in clement weather without it being too exotic, meaning you don't have to go deep down the field. Maybe you hit them on those short passes on the perimeter. Make sure you just turn around and hand it. Oh, well, this is taken in. It's complete. A big play there for Minnesota. They'll get down here, and now they're set up with a first and goal. And it's caught in the end zone for the Viking touchdown by Justin Jefferson. Four yards on the touchdown grab. And the Vikings are within an extra point of tying up this ball game. Good bounce back drive right there through the pick on drive number one. Drive number two leads them right down the field into the end zone. Go back out there and get it done again. Doesn't matter what the defense throws at them. They feel like they're in a groove right now, and they want to get out there and show it. Yeah, hoping to stay in that groove here this. He's got a man complete. Down the sideline he goes. Touchdown, Vikings. Justin Jefferson with his second touchdown here in this first half. And the Vikings have taken the lead. Cousins. Complete. Jefferson the target. And that led to a touchdown on the other side. So they need a response here. They certainly do. And I just have a question for you. You just went for it all on that one. This time, they were ready for it. Cousins able to... From the red zone now, Cousins. And it's caught in the end zone for the Viking touchdown by Justin Jefferson. A 14-yard touchdown. And the Vikings have made it a one-score game again here in the fourth. So how about that for an answer? They get the touchdown there, and it's back to a one-score game here in the fourth. And that's what these guys have done all game long. And not just hello. How about goodbye to the defense as he went past them? Big-time run on his first carry of the game. Cousins over the middle, and there's a diving catch. 23 yards on the play. To the air again, it's Cousins. Pass is tipped, but he's still able to bring it in. Down the left sideline. Touchdown, Vikings. Justin Jefferson, 68 yards. And the Vikings are back within a score. That's a score you felt they had to have here in the third quarter to get back in this game. And you know that there's an emphasis on their side. 10, once again, they'll go from the 40. They go play action. Cousins. That's caught at the 25. Touchdown, Vikings. Justin Jefferson, 60 yards. And the Vikings are on the board first here this afternoon. Well, 
they spoke about the importance of getting off to a good start. And they're on their first drive, Charles, into the end zone for the touchdown. And what an advantage for them. They're already clicking one drive in. Didn't need to wait to get up to full speed.